Hey YouTube, this is Dive Fly Fish. Just want to show you what I've done is I've replicated uh, Sergos and Whoopi Jumps toroid. And here is the toroid that I have. I've bought a thousand wines on both these, and I have 16 wines on the adjacent. So on this diagram, I have a thousand, thousand, sixteen, sixteen. I'm using the equivalent of TIP 31's really simple circuit. I have a 10K pot here. And I just want to show you um, what this is capable of doing and how little voltage. So from a replicating standpoint of uh, a gigantic jewel thief, this seems to work very, very well. This bulb is a 2 watt, and I don't know if I'll be able to get to focus down here, but suffice it to say it is a 69 milliamp, 120 volt LED bulb, 2 watt. And what I'm going to show you is that I have an input voltage, I'm going to have an input voltage of 1 volt, and when I uh, short this out, you'll see I have an input amp draw of 100 milliamps. So I'm going to use 1 volt and 100 milliamps. So slightly higher current than what the bulb calls for, uh, but a lot less voltage. So what I'm going to do now is we'll hook this up to the power supply. And I will hook up the negative here. All right, so here we go. We're going to take a look. We're going to have we have it at one volt. Now we'll turn it on. And there it is. Okay. So at 100 milliamps, and it's drawing right now four tenths of a volt, and we have it on full on, which I find absolutely phenomenal. So for the standpoint of uh, having a very, very efficient lighting system with two TIP31s. I'm sure it would even be better if I had four, but I ran out of my other ones, so I don't have any other ones besides these two. Um, but that's it. So that's as bright as lines as you could hope for, and I'm using one volt and 100 milliamps going in. So I thought you might find that interesting. And again, thank you to Whoopi Jump and Sergo from overunity.com. Um, I'm very, very happy and pleased with this circuit, and I think this has a lot of potential. So adding a few more trannies in there and seeing what we can get this system to generate is uh, well worth it. So again, that's pretty impressive, 100 milliamps and less than 1 volt to get 120 uh, volt main lines LED to go. As a matter of fact, this efficient in this inductor is so efficient that I can actually hand spin my chromery to get this bulb to light to that intensity without using any type of power. So um, I'm using, by the way, 28 gauge wire for the thousand turns here, thousand turns here, and then 16 gauge wire for the 16 turns here and the 16 turns there. And again, this is a compliment of Sergo from overunity.com and uh, a reiteration or my variant on Whoopi's, uh, Whoopi Jumps gigantic oscillator. So for what it's worth, interesting. Have a great day.